Thank you, Jen, for coming on the podcast. Classic post-podcast pit out. Those are bad. I might need a new shirt. Okay, much better. You actually don't need this microphone to be held. I can put this on a desk or something like that. I think the theme of this weekend is gonna be voluntary discomfort. No, I need to use my non-dominant hand. Put yourself into a unfamiliar and uncomfortable situation so that way you're dealing with it now. When the time does come, when you're thrown into that situation, you're able to approach it with that much more clarity. So I'd rather walk seven miles now with all the stations around than when I'm stranded in the woods or maybe your car breaks down. I'm gonna include in here my uh, travel checklist. So this is what I use when I'm doing some traveling. Hopefully this is helpful for you, but I think having some kind of checklist for me to remember that each time is really challenging. I would recommend making your own. Every time we make this drive, it rains heavily. Oh crap, we are fishtailing. You just sound. Today is the day before race day. Here at my old childhood home, my ankle is still barely hanging in there. So. All right, see you tomorrow morning. Normally you train for uh, something like this where you're walking a lot of distances. I've only been able to do two miles before my ankle is completely busted. And we'll be going an extra five on top of that to do seven. Three, two, one. It'll work out. George, mile two, how are we feeling? Not quite mile two, 1.7. The ankle. It hurts, but it's only mile two. Woo, beep beep. Woo. Here's a nice view of the water. My finger in the way. That was fun, I did it. Seven miles with George. Good seeing you. Travel Bye. Voluntary discomfort. Was there some discomfort, Emily? Yes.
What does the term voluntary discomfort mean to you? When you face a situation where you feel disequilibrium, you feel off, kind of off balance, but you kind of voluntarily take that on because you know you're going to grow. Nice. That was a good answer. Equilibrium. Disequilibrium. There she goes. That's the ocean. Right 7.42 p.m. This has been really good for me. This has been pushing me as a filmmaker. I'm having to think beyond just a one or two hour video shoot. I'm having to think all the time about what's the next shot. And then I have to think, hey, I can't overshoot this because there's only one person editing. My ankle held up really well. I think tomorrow morning we will see if I uh, feel better or worse. All right, today I'm just going through and reviewing some of the clips from yesterday just so the workload doesn't get too crazy. Just got done with JV soccer coaching, it didn't rain on us, which was awesome. It's been a solid weekend, it was really fun. My dad, 72 years old, holy crap, did a 12K, 7.4 miles, very impressive. For him to accomplish that was amazing. It was a really fun weekend. And the reason why I choose to do things is because of voluntary discomfort. Push yourself before you have to actually take it on in real life. Woo! That's a wrap. I'm doing a giveaway for Guitar Hero, giving away the second game, the third game, and a PlayStation 2. So you can check out in the description all the giveaway details and how you can win your own rocking out experience. All right, this could be yours.